This is Roxy. I love to take her with me, but she can't jump into my car. Therefore, I have lots of scratches on my bumper. And I have a new car. Not going to happen with my new car. Let me show you why. So I have created a prototype of a product that I think will help. I have a new car now, and I don't want those same old scratches. Let me show you what it was like before. So because Roxy is just a little bit too hefty and the car is just a little bit too high, she's never been able to jump into the back. She's tried hundreds and hundreds of times and created so many little scratches that the back of the car doesn't even look shiny anymore. It's just all scratches. Even when I help her, her claws still do a number. Not anymore. Because of the dog scratch bumper guard, your dog won't slip and the scratches won't appear. It will protect your bumper. Here's how I did it. So I used an old yoga mat, two inch Velcro that I purchased at Walmart, and a pair of scissors. Cut your yoga mat to the exact opening of your hatchback. Then you'll have the exact measurement of how long your Velcro pieces should be. Cut both the vel and the crow part, the soft and the grabby part, to measure. Then attach the part that's grabby to your yoga mat. The soft, felty part will be attached to the back of your car. You can see that it almost matches perfectly. It's almost not even visible. Then stick the two Velcros together and voila. I like having it so that it drapes down over the entire bumper. And because it's soft and flexible, it folds up nicely underneath my dog bed. Let's go in the car. Ready? Let's go. Let's go. So all I have to do is tell Roxy to sit and stay. She's very obedient. She allows me to open the back of the car and get her mat ready. Then I tell her, okay. And she props up her front feet and gets ready for me to lift her in. And the entire time, she's still trying to help, so those claws are still scratching away. But that rubber material protects my car and gives her something to grab on to. For dogs that don't sit and stay as easily, I would suggest starting with a leash for your training. Tell them to stay. Then fold open your cover. And when you're ready, tell them okay tell them to jump up, whatever your command is. And then when they're in safely, you can fold up the mat and close the hatchback. Now, scratches also come from the exit. So I command Roxy to stay, and then I pull down the mat till it covers the bumper entirely. And when I'm ready, I tell her to come. And to her, it's so exciting because she knows she's done something good. Then you just simply pick up the mat, fold it over. It's so soft and easy and flexible to work with. And then I just close it. Therefore, it's ready for the next use. No more scratches.